Wagwan everybody, Yadman Gaming here. We're back with the new video y'all been waiting for. It's time to start the dribble tutorial series, the game breaking, potentially game breaking. So if you need to check out my first dribble tutorial video, it, it has done well, but I expect this to do better, all right? Because I'm more, I'm more, I'm way more advanced now than back then. The first move we're gonna learn today. This is a move that you really do need to know. If you want to be an elite ball handler, you need to know this move. All right. Your favorite YouTubers use this move almost in every single game. So I'm gonna be showing you how to do the reverse spin one, momentum reverse spin and then momentum reverse spin to create space. But let's just get straight into this video, all right? But before we do that, I need y'all to hit that like button. Let's get this video to <sighs> stretching it. But because it's a tutorial, it's not stretching it. Three, three, 300 likes for the next one. You work with me, I work with you, everybody happy, is it? Hit that notify button and subscribe if you haven't already. So let's get straight into this video. All right, the first move that I told you guys we're gonna be practicing is the reverse spin. Now, as I said before, if you don't know how to get to the court where I'm at right now, I explained it in the last video. Some of y'all didn't get the notification, so make sure y'all go and check it out. I explained it in the last video, all right? Now, the first move we're gonna be doing is the reverse spin. That's not what you wanna do right there. It's, it's, it's something that you have to perfect the way that you flick the analog. That's not what you wanna do. I'm gonna show you how to do it, all right? Because sometimes, there you go. That's the move you wanna learn how to do. That's the move you wanna know how to do just off running. And anybody can do it. If you do it the wrong way, that's what you're gonna get right there or that right there. That's not what you want, all right? You wanna do a move, speed boost, then do it. Do a move, speed boost, then do it. The controller and the gameplay are not synced. I'm just showing you how to do the moves on the controller. So hold R2, move the left stick in the direction you're going, and then flick the right stick in a clockwise direction, and that'll make you do the reverse spin. And if you were doing it in the opposite direction, it's the same thing, but flip everything around. So instead of clockwise, you're going to do counterclockwise and you're going to flick the left stick in the left direction. Also, let go of turbo while you're doing the spin animation. The next move we're going to be teaching is the momentum spin. All right, I showed you how to do the spin already. The reverse spin, now you need to trigger it with the momentum. And I taught you guys how to momentum. If you guys don't know the momentum, then you need to watch my dribble tutorial because I'm not gonna go over all that. Now I will be teaching you how to chain it, but I'm not gonna be going too in depth into it. All right, now it's important to know how to do everything I'm showing you because in, you can't do all everything that you just seen on the screen without learning how to do the momentum spin. It's it's very important. All right, so that's the first step. All right, now momentum spin. Whichever hand you like dribbling, whichever way you like going, it's easy to momentum. You want to momentum and do the same move I just told you. But when you're, when you're spinning, let go of everything. Once again, the controller and the gameplay are not synced. This move is very simple, but it creates some of the most difficult moves if you learn how to chain it. Now, you see on the screen, you're gonna speed boost, and the direction I'm going is to the right, so momentum and spin the right analog stick the same way you saw me do it. All right, I taught you all the momentum spin. I taught you all the reverse spin. Now y'all know what's next. It's y'all favorite YouTubers moves. And I'm gonna show you right now. 
that move right there, your favorite YouTuber's moves, I'm, I'm talking about the momentum spin, step back. That's the move I'm gonna be showing y'all to do. And it works, trust me. I just don't do it a lot in part because I don't think about it, I haven't done it enough. I really learned how to do this myself, all right? By just playing around in the mic court. I didn't see no good tutorial out there that really taught you how to do it. So I'm gonna be showing you how to do it. Especially for those people that plays twos, twos is gonna become a lot more sweaty. So what you wanna do is get some space first because it's hard to do it around the free throw area line. Momentum, step back, all right? That's what you're looking for. As soon as you do the move I just taught you, it's one simple step. One simple step. Once again, the controller and the gameplay are not synced. No. As soon as you do the move that I just taught you, the momentum spin, it's one step that's added. It's all about timing though. As soon as the ball crosses over or is in the process of crossing over to the other hand when your momentum spin, you wanna tap the, the right stick to the right. And if you momentum to the left and counterclockwise spin, you're gonna tap the right stick to the left. It's just that simple. This move is deadly. Deadly. I know y'all see y'all favorite YouTubers using this move, and I'm gonna be doing this move a lot more in the park. Now y'all gonna need to practice these moves. Like I take, like I said, it takes repetition. It takes practice. It takes. It's gonna take some time to learn these moves because even I didn't perfect these moves in just 10 minutes. It took repetition to know when to tap it at the right time. I'm showing you the blueprint, but you're still gonna have to apply these just like any dribble moves I've showed you in the past. You're still gonna have to apply it and learn it. Now that pretty much wraps up episode one of this dribble tutorial series. Now this dribble tutorial series is gonna last as long as I learn new dribble moves. I just need y'all's help as well. It takes time to make these videos, so it don't take much time to, to just smack that like button. You see me? <laughs> so hit that like button and let's get this video to 300 likes and we'll get another video on a tutorial next week. You see me? Because I work full time and I'm trying to put videos out at the same time on the weekdays. Dribble tutorial videos takes a long time, so work with me. Master these moves, perfect them, so when I put the next move out, it's gonna be a smooth transition. With that being said, big up on yourself, big up the Lord Almighty. Without all, I try to make this video as small as possible. Yard Man Gaming Gone.